there, Titans. I'm your host, Elaine Kong, and welcome to Titan Weekly, your information source for the latest news, trends, and events going on this week. If you're taking classes at Fullerton College or you simply live near that community, you have the opportunity to charge your electric car for free. Members of the community and owners of electric vehicles can now charge them in the ports located near the campus parking structure facing Lemon Street. Up to six vehicles can be charged at the same time in this location. This is a great opportunity for owners of electric vehicles who struggle to find a good place to recharge. For anyone who would like to use these charging ports, they will have to register through ChargePoint at na.chargepoint.com register. Mattel announced last month that they will release various versions of Barbie dolls, including a curvy, petite, and tall version of Barbie with various skin tones and eye colors. Now, these aren't the only versions of Barbies. Two people have created their own versions of these dolls and given them a whole new character. One of them, Socality Barbie, was created to poke fun at the Instagrammers who claim to live authentically. The other is the Hajarbi, a Barbie who has a hijab and outfits specifically made to represent a culture not seen in dolls we buy off shelves. How great would it be to know your college tuition will be paid for and you're only five years old? Well, thanks to Marty Burbank and his wife Song Chung Burbank, a kindergarten class at Rio Vista Elementary won't have to worry about paying for tuition. The couple from Fullerton said they want to help give these students a chance to go to school and graduate as a class of 2032. It is estimated that it will take about $1 million to cover the costs of two years of a community college and two years of a CSU, or the equivalent if they decide to go to other colleges and universities. The British rock band Coldplay was recently under fire for their newest music video titled Him for the Weekend. Some have speculated that the video is appropriating Indian culture. Their song is a collaboration with Beyonce, who is dressed in what should be traditional Indian clothing, but does not represent a positive image of Indian people. Audiences have responded negatively, claiming cultural appropriation and stereotypical images of Asia. It seems like everyone will have their own interpretations on this song and its video. Cal State Fullerton's theater department is getting ready for their spring 2016 productions. One of them is none other than The Miracle Worker. This is the story of Helen Keller, a girl who is blind, mute, and deaf, along with her teacher Annie Sullivan. The story follows the struggle Sullivan endures to help Keller, who is trapped within herself, and the success that comes when she finally utters a word. This production will hit the stage starting February 19th and continue until March 13th at the Hallberg Theater. Tickets are available from the Performing Arts Center box office. Thanks for watching Titan Weekly. I'm Elaine Kong. We will see you next week.